Can I just say something? I'm I'm really happy that Rahul Kamal has joined us on the show. Sorry. Oh. Oh. At least you could have said Boria, dude. <laughs> Oh no, my but, god, but the bird is going to have to get cut out. I think you made a very fair point. And cricket could be used, you know, in diplomacy. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of 575 ounces. This is EP number what guys? This is EP number 4. Huh? Yeah. Not bad yaar. Teen lagatar humne yahan pe episodes kare hain cricket ke bare mein. Aur bulao main football wale log. Huh? <laughs> 575 ounces. So of course sir, we're joined in studio by Vaibhav Raghunandan and a freshly shaved freshly shaved shining Siddhan Dani. Sir burning question to ye hai ki बीवी की कौन सी डांट पड़ी आपको ये आपको दाढ़ी ये निकालनी पड़ी मैं यार आई शुड हैव प्रिपेयर्ड फॉर दिस आंसर हां एनीवे नंदलेस सो दिस इज माय वंस अ ईयर इट्स माय वंस अ ईयर समर क्लेंज है समर क्लेंज हां सो मतलब अब वापस बैक टू द बियर्ड लाइक बाय बाय साल भर तक लाइक या लाइक बाय बाय थैंक्स ठीक है भाई वो Uh, इस एपिसोड में वाइटली इम्पोर्टेंट सब्जेक्ट ऑफ माई फेशियल है इज इट डन नाउ फिनिश्ड नेक्स्ट एपिसोड ऑल्सो वेन यू गेट अट स्टबल गोइंग बात दोस्तों आज अफगानिस्तान की हो रही है बिकॉज जनरली यू नो बी फोकसिंग ऑन द टीम्स आर डूइंग वेल द बिग मैच लाइक इंडिया पाकिस्तान विच इज अ बिड ऑफ नो शो वेब ऑफ नॉट अग्रीम विद द थिंग इज लाइक अफगानिस्तान आई थिंक एवरी वन विल बी एन अग्रीमेंट दैट irrespective that this is their second world cup they have been considered as the minnows already before the tournament started they have still disappointed even further beyond that five matches played five matches lost and there's just so much shit that's been going on outside of the field for them which is sort of plays into what is happening on the field for them right now so first and foremost yaar hum log yahan baat kar rahe the 10 nation tournament hai and the the point of having a 10 nation tournament is that you know the level playing field is maintained that every game is tight no game comes across as you know uh, uh ki matlab ek dusre pe haavi ho gaya and it's just a bit of a, bit of a no contest ie england taking on afghanistan uh, they missed out on 400 by 3 runs in that match i'll tell you one thing i'm sorry i'm digressing a little bit which ever player we talk to which ever play we do a show on whenever you say okay now you're playing afghanistan isn't it going to be a very easy game not a single player says no you cannot take them lightly you have to take them with all seriousness because they are a good team they are that of our england ja ke pehle liye 397 i think what afghanistan be... lost by 150 runs that game na 150 runs man and you know, oen morgan ne 148 mare the so if they could have caught him then ho sakta tha to mazak ho raha tha us din bhai par kya maar raha tha wo yaar 17 chakke ridiculous but it tells you a lot about afghanistan's bowling a lot about afghanistan's approach just to put into perspective what all has happened outside of the field Uh, a month before the world cup the ceo was changed the ceo who is very close with all the players that formed a big part of this team coming to where they are uh, then the captain of this team was changed captain of this team was changed uske baad the, their opener who seems like he sits at nathu sweets he was asked to go back in the middle of the tournament then the opener when he's gone back in the middle of the tournament has cried foul by saying look uh, someone from the board has forced me back I am perfectly fit, so it's me. कुछ खराब है नहीं. Then in all the five games, not once has Afghanistan come with an unchanged eleven. कोई ना कोई किसी को बदले जा रहा है वहाँ पे. You know what I'm saying? So there's no uh, uh, there's no consistency in the eleven. You know. Uh, and then of course there's Rashid Khan. All hopes were on Rashid Khan, what he would do. And Rashid Khan की जो पिटाई हुई है इस World Cup में. I honestly feel that this could be a game changer for Rashid Khan because he is honestly a champion bowler he is a top quality bowler this will force him to take a step back and you know generally jab aapki itni patai hoti hai field pe kabhi kabhi aap you take a step back and say ki yaar ab main kya alag kar sakta hu and that can enable a player to go to a bigger higher better level but can i also just say that uh, rashid was also let down in the previous game against england 
by some really bad fielding. Shoddy fielding. Yeah, yeah, I mean, very early in Ian Morgan's innings, they dropped him off Rashid Khan's bowling. And yeah. he must have just been sitting there and thinking, I don't have IPL in IPL. You know, there is no such fielding with oh, oh, oh. my IPL teammates. Ke saath. So, and it's okay, Agreed. I also think a lot, he's, a lot of people have made fun of how many runs he's conceded and this and that. But a lot of leg spinners, a lot of wrist spinners, they've come up in his defense and said that this happens. This happens when you're, especially with this bowling style he has, which is hmm. that he gives a little bit of flight, he has a fairly predictable one delivery. So it happens sometimes, it was just a bad day. But yeah, they have been shown up very badly, Afghanistan. And I think in terms of just the cricket, in cricket… South Africa also lost all their games? South Africa have they lost… They won one game. They beat Afghanistan. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's fair. Doesn't speak yes. very highly of them, given their history and, you know, background in the game. But uh, Afghanistan ka focus, even I forgot to mention Phil Simmons, who is their coach right now, the great Phil Simmons of West Indies. He said that he would not renew his contract already. He said that as the World Cup will be closed, I will open the door. I will open the door about what, how this board is treating the players, how this board is treating the players, how this board is trying to, you know, always meddle around with what he is trying to do and with the selection of the players. So, he is also going to open the door to open the door. I think so the coach… So, clearly the vibes in that team are not good. Because, honestly speaking, if you talk about the Afghanistan prior to the World Cup, you would always say that irrespective of win or lose, they fight. Yeah. They always give it a fight. Body language pe dikhta hai that they are fighting, whether the skill levels are not there or not. In this World Cup, that fight is missing. So and my guess is that fight is missing because the unity in the camp is missing. Of course, at the end of the day, the ones that we are seeing and we can criticize because we see them are the players. But because of all this background drama that's going on, I don't really see how the players are essentially… I mean, you're saying a lack of unity in, in the camp. It, it seems to me that it's more a case of the players having taken the fight to a different plane where they are engaged in a fight not so much on the pitch but, but with their own board and how cricket is run in that country. And because uh, for what it's worth now, a little bit of investment is coming into Afghanistan cricket predominantly from India. Yeah. Uh, Amul, for example, being the sponsors of their national team. As one I mean, example. we've given them, they play they in India. It, yeah, they play, of course. Yeah. Dehradun and Greater Noida being their home grounds. Home bases. Yeah. Uh, so, the fight has become, or is about, I mean, it, I, I guess, if you're looking at it from a point of view of being one of the big, bigger or top 10 cricket playing countries, Afghanistan is now there, right? So, automatically, they'll eventually end up playing more and more cricket. If things are done, if things proceed. Because everyone in the region is keen on that's not simple, no no that's not actually the no no because dude Afghanistan like from a like a I suppose strategic geopolitical perspective is extremely important to all the countries in the region. Everyone wants to be friends with Afghanistan. But nobody right. wants to nobody is playing agreed, the agreed, cricket point, in that. Right? Uh, nobody is uh, playing cricket with them. No no though. not maybe not yet. These things also take time to happen. Hmm. But the fact that for example India is extending training facilities to them at perhaps no cost or mm. a cost that's borne by the BCCI. Is, these are diplomatic sort of maneuvers, na? It's what a digression, but what, what I was, I guess the point that I was trying to get at was that Afghanistan board ke paas ab I guess thoda paisa hai. Aur iske karan obviously jo power mein hai, wo hera feri jaysa hota hai har jagah. Hoi to, hoi to mein kera ho. Wo ho raha hai. So that upheaval process, wo process hogi. And hopefully wo at some point, agar ye sab log if a legendary former cricketer like Phil Simmons comes out and says whatever he does and he has evidence yeah. to back it up as having been in that position and gone through the process, I'm sure he'll have emails, whatever, whatever. But he's, he's also saying that because uh, he's had a horrendous campaign as coach. Yeah. So, if he's looking for a job elsewhere, which of course he's looking no, for a job in Afghanistan, campaign as he's coach. saying, Haan, Isne, this has played a major part. Jo bhi hai, at least uh, it comes with some level of authenticity, of course. Uh, and ho when you say horrendous uh, sort of tenure as coach, I don't know, sorry, how long he's been the coach or whatever. But if Afghanistan have gone through the qualifying process as the top team in that process, I think, mm -hmm. then obviously the, whoever is the coach hasn't done so badly. Because obviously they are not a top tier nation, they are a second tier cricket playing nation. No, they are a full member. No, they might be a full member, mm. but 
it's a new sport for them they're getting there actually i find this I whole agree. thing a little funny i, I must also just say that they they like full members and yeah, half members yeah it just makes me feel like you know, i mean pichli baar wo kachi mitti ke dure the waise hi karna chahiye no but <laughs> webber was he he's talking about more games uh, huh. how about drawing like the the story of this world cup has been bangladesh hmm. yeah hands down बिकॉज अभी तो बिग बॉयज की ना कहानी आई नहीं है क्योंकि अनफॉर्चुनेटली लेफ्ट माई स्टाफ टाइगर इन द कार बट अच्छा नहीं बट वॉट इज द नंबर्स प्लेड एंड नाउ अफगानिस्तान So uh, Bangladesh in the their first World Cup was 1999 again in England, and uh, between the period of their first World Cup and the second World Cup, they played 54 ODI matches, and they won oh. two. Okay, they won two. They won two. In oh. the period between the last World Cup and the beginning of this World Cup, Afghanistan have played 65, and they won like. a decent number more than yeah yeah they won series they won yes series, they won right? series but the difference yeah. is that bangladesh when they were playing they were playing sides that were better than them always were, always always almost always they were playing sides that were better than them whereas afghanistan yeah. in the last 4 years have played the teams that are playing this world cup which are the top 10 nations in the world they only played these nations 12 times in the last 4 years the they only played one member of the top 5 ever before this world that cup that was india that was india at the asia cup and mm-hmm. in 2019 they have not played any of these nations mm-hmm. none of them they have not even played they have only played ireland and scotland that's mm-hmm. it so for them to come into this and they have never played in england before having gone there and played this world cup so all these things yeah. make a difference just having a very low level of experience a lot of their players i think the total number of odis that afghanistan have played in their cricketing history is 119 which i think mm. uh, virat kohli played in like the first 4 years of his career <laughs> also i feel a majority of their makeup is uh, t20 players yeah absolutely and yes it is they book approach bahar aati hai and they and they do like i think afghanistan have chance hi kahan milta hoga longer formats khelne ka yaar exactly jab and it, i think bangladesh ne jab shuru kiya tha 1990 it didn't mein, exist us time t20 cricket nahi hota tha ha so actually that also makes a huge difference because bangladesh are concentrating on t20 i mean uh, sorry bangladesh i'm saying afghanistan because are, that's how their players can get out of afghanistan yes, play cricket exactly. make make some cash Absolutely. money there's the afghan league also now yes there's the afghan league also and so, i think chris gale played in it last time I think he played yeah, in that. Yeah, but it's a big difference. So I think again the big difference between also Bangladesh and Afghanistan, since we are drawing these parallels, they both, hmm. I suppose, as from a cricket point of view, really, it's a good thing for both countries that they are in South Asia, and so you will always have competitions like the Asian Asia uh, Cup, but Asia Cup, whatever. So you'd get at least some of those big ticket games. Every once in a while, just to say okay. But that's all you get. But, but no, Asia but Cup Bangla- is once in once in four years. Uh, yeah. I mean, I'm sure uh, anyway. But Bangladesh also has a massive domestic market, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. That, that makes it, I think. But वो massive domestic market को I know. But जो अभी हालात घर पे हैं उनके, उस massive domestic market को कभी अपने घर पे अपनी team को देखते हुए तो उनको chance मिलना है नहीं इतना. That's I think the this this parallel then again can be drawn with Pakistan now. Which is कि जब आप घर पे नहीं खेल पा रहे हैं, जब आपके घर पे crowds आपको देख नहीं पा रहे हैं, then it just becomes ये सब तो yeah because if you if you get to watch your team back home yeah. and you watch them in flesh and blood, yeah. that in turn is preparing the new generation. Yes, you it know, does. You know उनको वो field में जाके देखते हैं, हम में से कितने लोग stadiums में जाके हमने match देखे हैं, they players who impressed all of us and because of that we want to get onto the field the very next day mm. and play and uh, you know so the same thing should happen. For Afghanistan, but what won't happen in the future, right now at least, in the near future, you can't see that happening. <laughs> so no, what I'm saying is that it's fine. Like Afghanistan can't play at home, but India has given them two stadiums here to call yeah. home. Okay. The second point being, they can go and play outside. There is enough support outside for them. Their matches are yeah. being attended quite well. well. There is yeah, a lot of Afghan support. Afghan yes, there is a good Afghan population in all no, these no, but countries. But the point about Point like it's the same for the Afghan national football team, right? Hmm. A majority of their players are based in Europe. Yes. Yeah. Or uh, North America, perhaps. 
and they come together when they play for the national team they rarely play at home when they uh, they play in competitions like everybody else does uh, so until like it's possible to encourage people to watch and make contact with these hmm. idols or whatever they are on the ground over there the kids man like when we for, i mean char panch saal jab aap first time hmm. someone chucks a jersey at you across the fence you know that's the, that's what makes it happen i've literally that's never had a jersey chucked at me yeah somatai shaiza and and abhi abhi batao kya ho raha hai abhi kya ho raha hai afghanistan ka ki uh, they are ikattha kar rahe hain players are domestic hmm. structure to hai nahi wahan pe and we all know ki domestic structure in any team doing well in world cricket whether it is the big boys the small boys whoever you need a sound and solid domestic structure yeah और उस डोमेस्टिक स्ट्रक्चर को आने में 10 साल लग जाएंगे आराम से यार हां मतलब जल्द जल्दबाजी नहीं करनी चाहिए आई थिंक इट्स फाइन लाइक इट विल टेक टाइम इट विल तो 10 साल अगर आपके डोमेस्टिक स्ट्रक्चर को आने में लगेंगे उसके 10 साल बाद आपके पास खिलाड़ी तैयार होंगे हां यू नो आई एम सेइंग सो इन 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 अ सेंस इट टुक बांग्लादेश एंड व्हाट दे डूइंग राइट नाउ इन द 2019 वर्ल्ड कप यस दे वर दे बीट इंग्लैंड इन 2015 बट 99 टू 2019 20 साल सर और उस 20 साल के गैप में एटलीस्ट पांच छह कोर प्लेयर हैं जो 10 साल से एक साथ खेल रहे हैं yes, और अब जाके यू you नो know, उनको मिठाई का वो मीठापन मिल रहा है इन 2011 व्हेन बांग्लादेश प्लेड साउथ अफ्रीका एंड ढाका दे वर बीटन रियली बैडली आई थिंक दे गॉट आउट फॉर अंडर हंड्रेड रन एंड देन इन एट ईयर्स सिंस देव प्लेड अ लॉट मोर क्रिकेट इन द लास्ट फोर ईयर्स देव प्लेड अबाउट हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी ओडीआई and they won almost half of them more than half of them and they beat south africa in this world cup so it makes yeah. it different like this is the legacy of that 1999 team this yeah this is that legacy like exactly on your the, point the about generation. on your yeah. point about domestic club structure or domestic structure in general yesterday dalima chabbar was uh, in studio and we were talking to her about the situation with indian the, national football team yeah, yeah with the women's uh, women's football mm. in general Mm. and the issues there are the same that essentially yeah. some nations or in some parts of the world you get to play a lot yeah and in other parts you don't get to play at all mm. so if you're not playing how you how are you going to play <laughs> it's yeah. exactly that like it's absolutely like that's exactly the parallel to draw which is that if you don't play how do you get better or how do you play Whatever, how do you grow yeah, how do you play na agar aap khel hi nahi rahe hain to fir baat hi khatam bilkul and so, that's yeah and and you you look at you look at bangladesh's players bhai some some players are really really top class players honestly speaking I mean, rashid khan ke alawa uh, mujibur rahman hai yaar hmm. there's a nabi who for me honestly if i had to pick between rashid mujibur and nabi i would pick nabi nabi is the most solid player in terms of international cricket he's solid with the bat and he's solid with the ball you know hmm. and he's a he's a consistent performer you know it, it looks like whenever you see him on the field when you see him playing on the field it looks like he belongs there hmm. and whoever you talk to him in his franchise sunrisers hyderabad also everyone any former player also everyone the first thing they say about nabi is yaar kya player is this guy is a solid solid player the only hmm. thing i think they need to focus on their batting I don't see any big batsman coming through and a tear away fast bowlers you know i think they had a tear away fast bowler who is now a tear away medium pace bowler <laughs> so that's uh, that's what knee injuries do to you guys <laughs> i was talking to one of these former players and uh, he was telling me about some of the politics that used to exist when he was playing and how it still exists and i was like i'm amazed man even at the highest level of sport where you have 15 people who have the highest level of dedication the highest level of so on and so forth and you know quality even there they backbiting there is you know bitching going on there is usko pehle le liya there is selection issues even there to fir afghan cricket kya hai wahan pe to 100% hoga like you mentioned abhi abhi paisa aaya hai naya naya jab paisa aata hai to suddenly hadapne ke liye wo aadat hoti hai kyunki wo paisa dekha nahi hota utna aur usse of course it branches out to all the other bad things that follow so this this afghan cricket issue i think will continue for a while man and uh, let's see probably the next world cup will give you a smaller indication will give you a clear indication if they are playing the next world cup that if they've made progress or not because if you look at bangladesh they took tiny steps and it's because of those tiny steps their foundation was solid yeah. you know they didn't take a massive leap ki ekdam suddenly bangladesh aage because then you crumble also suddenly all of a sudden and i think the so best think thing about cricket steps, 
the best thing about cricket is that the next world cup ka format will be completely different because that's how cricket works <laughs> so i'm sure in logo ko chance mil jayega yaar matlab agar itna hum sab bol rahe hain jab humne pehla show kiya tha tab bhi hum yahi baat bol rahe the ki aapke paas it panch che to aur cricket playing countries hai duniya mein jo seriously thoda khel rahe hain theek hai aap unko kyun nahi include kar rahe hain is show piece event mein अभी भी हम वही बात बोल रहे हैं अगर चाहे आप इस बारे में बात कर लो कि क्लोज फिनिशेस नहीं हो रहे हैं तो या कंपेटिटिव सम टीम्स आर नॉट बीइंग कंपेटिटिव इनफ अगर आप आयरलैंड स्कॉटलैंड यू थ्रो देम इन द मिक्स कपल ऑफ अदर कंट्री जिम्बाब्वे यू गेट यू विल गेट दोज क्लोज फिनिशेज यू विल गेट दोज टाइटली कंटेस्टेड गेम्स दे मे नॉट बी ऑफ लाइक पहैप्स द क्वालिटी दैट इंडिया इज प्लेइंग दीज डेज और ऑस्ट्रेलिया और बांग्लादेश but it will still be good competitive cricket and at the end of the day it's a summer time sport I, I, meant- i don't agree i i don't think the world cup is a place to uh, you know breed new players i think i think the four years between the world cup is a place to breed new players i'm saying if my aim is ki agar aap us 4 saal mein and here the icc should take out a ruling and i don't know how much of their ruling really matters to all these nations but the icc should take out a ruling that once in a year or once in two years you have to play a, a team that is uh, you know ranked 9th and below just so that you aid in the development of the sport so once in two years aapko khelna hai once in two you years know, so that can be a solution but once in two years what one odi game once in two years or no, like no, a series you are right, right like, like this is not usko aap ek nation ke nazariye se soch rahe ho par agar har nation ke upar aaya to suddenly aapke paas you know in that one year a big team is playing a small team like afghanistan on two or three times two three series hmm. and that can go a long way so that they don't have yeah. uh, showings like this then so baba no, the absolutely only thing, what you are saying is my only like point a... is that the only jurisdiction that the icc has in this sort of a scenario is in icc events yeah. so the only place they can do it essentially is at the world cup or See, unfortunately the, the icc is the their control over the sport only is ki they get the federations together that's it they cannot organize bilateral series between federations india and australia when they f- we play each other there's nothing to do with the icc it's got to do yeah. with cricket australia and the bcci and for what you're saying is absolutely right because uh, i was speaking to the ceo of scotland cricket and he said that yeah. scotland cricket and the ecb had this exactly what you're saying agreement. this this agreement that they would play each other uh, three times e- every year and yeah. they had this going on for a few years and this year just before the and world cup to. they used to also no they the the agreement is now going to come to an end in 2019 and the ecb does not want to renew it and actually okay. the last time that england and scotland played each other scotland beat england scotland the highest ranked of the associate members I mean, I, beat the top ranked full member some of this logic just i don't and, understand the logic if you go to an Uh, a Scotland England game in the UK anywhere yeah. uh, I mean in either England this is or ex- Scotland this is exactly what he said uh, why would you, you not get a full absolutely that's exactly what he said what he said was England was a Scotland at lords will be f- packed yeah. like does not matter what format of the game you're playing or what sport or what playing. sport you're playing it's going to be packed mm. yeah. and yeah so it's also it comes down to the bigger nations being uh, dildar enough to say ki bhai and yeah, i guess the difference so that's an ideal 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 scenario bilkul ideal yeah. scenario would be that ki you you forego a couple of your uh, millions that you make every year but yeah. the only problem is in cricket none of the boards like it's not spread out across all boards kafi boards ke paas paisa hi nahi hai yaar hmm. so west indies jahan chase kar raha hai ki mujhe ek india ke sath series khelna hai yeah, west yeah, indies absolutely. chase kar raha hai mujhe ek australia ke sath series khelna hai kyunki us series ke badolat se apne ko tv rights milte hain paisa aata hai thoda hamare board ke paas paisa aata hai wo paisa hum thoda players ko de sakte hain and so on and so forth ab usko agar aap uske upar aapne ruling dal di ki bhai sahab aapne ek saal mein ek bari ek top 9 ya below wali nation ke sath series khelna hoga ga sir पैसे का है सीरीज बनाने के ये नहीं नहीं तो मनी टू होल्ड एक एक मिनट तो पैसे फिर आईसीसी देगा ना यार जहां जहां शॉर्ट फॉल होता है आ, अगर आप अगर आप कुछ डिक्टेट दे रहे हैं तो आपको फिर फैसिलिटेट भी तो करना बनता है लिसन दी एजम्पशन दी एजम्पशन नहीं है दैट इज योर एजम्पशन हां ना इट आई एम सेइंग इट्स थ्योरेटिकली पॉसिबल आई थिंक आल्सो वी आर लाइक वी आर अज्यूमिंग दैट इफ अ बिग टीम प्लेस अ स्मॉल टीम पैसा नहीं आएगा which is wrong yeah, yeah which is absolutely wrong kam like kam paisa aayega ha kam paisa aayega compared to like it won't be like the ashes oi, oi. 
But I care of that's what I'm saying. Take a hit. Yeah. I'm not it's saying it's fine. Exactly. Zero. Yeah, yeah. It won't. I don't think you will incur a loss. By the way, I do not think you will incur a loss even in that situation. Like I mean, again, I'm going. I don't know, I can't. I'm, again, I'm going back to the conversation I had with the with Malcolm, the CEO of Scotland, and I'd asked him this. I said, "What what are the viewing figures like? What is the kind of attendance like? Do you guys actually is it breaking even?" He said, "They're really well attended, very well watched, and both teams end up." No, with no but he, of course he would say that. But no, that, it is known. Is that one sec? Is that is that restricted to only some of these traditional cultural rivalries like England versus Scotland, for example, or? I, I don't know. Perhaps if, even if it's England versus Scotland only, then let's just say England plays Scotland and Ireland. Mm. That could be like a thing you could do. Mm. South Africa can play Zimbabwe. They also yeah. apparently they support cricket Namibia. South uh, cricket South Africa put in a lot of money towards cricket Namibia, so yeah. that could be another. Fair enough. I've understood this now. So uh, guys, so that was a dis- decent discussion. In between, I think we went a little thub, but then the end card discussion was really nice. Uh, it makes sense, you know. I don't know if ICC will really implement these things. I think we're living in a uh, distorted reality. If you're thinking all these things are going to be happening, but it's it's a situation nonetheless that can be implemented. Uh, I mean, there's no reason why. And now that you see guys like Canada and all coming in, America wants to sort of make a foothold, and the big China, China is trying to come into cricket. Then you know it's only good for the game. China uh, actually have a very good cricket team that they are not uh, showing us by the way. They have a great cricket team who are world beaters. They're uh, first Chinese player. There was one Chinese player who played the Big Bash also, yeah. So okay, I'm, just, I'm just putting it out there. Do you, do you see Afghanistan winning a single game in this World Cup? I think their best chance was against Sri Lanka and they really blew it. So uh, nahi hone wala. Yeah, I don't think they're going because to Because now also all the teams that are going to be playing them, it's that latter half of the league. They'll say, yeah, ye to apne do point hai. So with that, we've come to an end of another episode of 575 Ounces as we were talking about uh, Afghanistan and how it's not really working for them in this World Cup. But if they do draw parallels from a certain Bangladesh, then the road is long, but the road is definitely not a impossible one. <laughs> There's light the climb the is definitely the not impossible. The climb is definitely not impossible. Siddhant Dani, Vaibhav Raghunandan, guys, thanks so much. Goodbye.